What is up guys? I'm Exotic Gaming and today I am back with another Pixel Gun 3D random weapon gameplay. Today's random weapon gameplay is another gameplay based off of a very popular TV series, this series called The Walking Dead. Now I'm pretty sure around 99% of the people watching this video have heard of The Walking Dead before. If you are part of the 1% who have not, then The Walking Dead is basically a TV series where there are a group of people and they are trying to survive the zombie apocalypse. And the only way to survive the oncoming hordes of zombies is to use a lot of different weapons. And when somebody by the name of Chicken Potato, no lie, that's his actual YouTube channel name, suggested that I should do a Walking Dead weapon gameplay, I thought it was a great idea. So shout out to you, Chicken Potato, for thinking up a great video idea. And without further ado, let's go jump right into today's video and showcase the weapons that I will be using that reflect on the weapons that they use in The Walking Dead. Starting out with our good old trusty primary weapon by the name of the AK-47, better known as the AK-48 UP2 in Pixel Gun 3D to avoid any copyright violations. Our backup weapon is one of the most powerful backups in Pixel Gun 3D, the Dual Revolver's UP2. Our melee weapon is Michonne's katana. Michonne is a character in The Walking Dead and her famous weapon that she uses is a katana. We do not have a special weapon because as you guys can see, there is not a single weapon in the special section which reflects on weapons that they use in The Walking Dead. So we are completely disregarding the special section throughout today's video. The sniper section weapon that we will be using is the good old crossbow UP2 and who can forget the rocket launcher known as the AT4 also known as the Apocalypse UP2 in Pixel Gun 3D as our premium weapon. So now that we got the introduction out of the way, I do want to talk about something here right at the very beginning because it's pretty much inevitable. Pretty much every single person who is watching this video is going to notice it. The fact that I now have Adamant Armor. Probably a lot of people are raging now seeing, like, saying why the heck I have Adamant Armor and I understand the exact reason why you would be mad, but I am actually the one who is the most mad. You guys might be a little confused as to why, and that's basically because over the past two days, on Thursday and Friday, I was trying to do a gift box opening video, and I actually spent over 100 freaking dollars trying to win the Golden Friends, and I never successfully won it. So, I have given up on trying to do that video, and I'm instead doing this random weapon gameplay because I really don't want to spend any more money on the Golden Friend because, in all honesty, no weapon in Pixel Gun 3D is worth $120. I really hope you guys understand that not a single item in Pixel Gun 3D is worth that amount of money, and, uh... I, I don't really want to go bankrupt over a single weapon from a single series. It's, it's not worth it. So hopefully you guys understand. That's also the reason why I didn't upload yesterday. And I did all mention this on my Instagram and my Twitter. So if you guys want to know um, like reasons why I don't upload or something or get sneak peeks at stuff, um, then be sure to go follow my Instagram and my Twitter so you guys can get that sort of information. But I would like to tell a little story here at the very beginning of this video, guys. You guys seem to enjoy the story that I told in my last random weapon gameplay, which was Dater Weapon gameplay. In that last random weapon gameplay, I basically talked about a story with this one kid who was, um... He was really, really weird. That's all I'm gonna say. Just watch the video to find out. But in this video, I would like to talk about how stupid I was a couple of days ago. So, as probably a lot of people who at least live in the U.S. know, Florida is a state known for its pretty nasty weather sometimes. Florida is a state known for these constant, like, thunderstorms that uh, just pop up out of nowhere, especially during summertime. But this winter, it's been just going on a lot, okay? There's just been so many of these freaking thunderstorms popping up, and it's just, it's been some pretty bad weather here in Florida so far. So... I basically have, like, this past month maybe had three thunderstorms, uh, th thunderstorm occurrences in where I live. Um, that's probably the same with most people living in Florida. And just the most recent one was a couple of days ago. And, uh, I was smart. Because I looked on the weather app of the iPhone and I realized, okay, well, there's going to be some rain coming and a thunderstorm. So I'm going to go take out my umbrella. Well, what I didn't understand was... When I actually went out into the thunderstorm, there were kind of a lot of winds going on. So, the problem was, when I was walking with my friend Kevin from my second to my third period class, there were like these 50 mile an hour wind gusts blowing around in every freaking direction. I was having trouble walking and everything. It was just, it was freaking scary, I gotta tell you. Okay, 50 miles an hour probably was in a little bit of an exaggeration, but it still felt a lot, okay? But, like, there was all these wind gusts going on, and I was being an idiot, and I'm like, 
Oh my god, it's gonna rain. Well, I'm just gonna go take out my umbrella. So the second I take out my umbrella and I open up my umbrella, the whole thing goes Mary Poppins on me and it goes inside out and goes bye-bye. So I lost my umbrella to me being an idiot and it was just, it was just a really bad day the whole rest of the day because I had lifting the rest of the day and uh, it was just all kinds of bad. So me being an idiot, um, yeah, that, I, I don't really have the much, as much common sense in the world, so, I broke an umbrella in a freaking tor hurricane, it was like a hurricane, like, I'm not even gonna lie, it was insane, it was absolutely insane, so, um, <laughs> Kevin was laughing at me, this kid, this kid's from Guangzhou, China, and he's sitting there, like, the next period, walking to class with me, he's like, Michael, why floor the weather so suck? And then I'm like, I don't freaking know. And then three seconds after he says that, he hits this puddle. I'm like, I don't even know how you can hit a puddle like like what he did. Okay, there's no oil on the road. It wasn't slippery at all. But this kid, he hits the puddle. Uh, Kevin, if you're watching this video, I know Kevin watches this video. Kevin, Kevin, no harm done. But um, he, he hits the freaking puddle and he just falls down in front of like 300 people all walking to their classes. So Kevin got pretty sad. Kevin ran into the building, and that was the last I saw of Kevin that day. So it was pretty funny. Not even going to lie, guys, all right? It was it was a pretty interesting day for me, okay? So, yeah. All right. I actually don't have any stories, though, from uh, today. Today was a really actual, eh, I mean, because, you know, I'm in 11th grade, so I have to think about colleges. I was visiting a bunch of colleges, and uh, my school apparently is a school where the girls do not look that fantastic um and i i didn't even understand that okay i'm just complete flat out saying that right now i did not realize that until today because there was about like five or six uh different high schools that went to um university of central florida for this college fair, fair type thing and um i realized quickly that there were a lot of girls and i was just like Whoo -wee! man that is that is okay i'm done <laughs> everybody's just like exotic please stop Please just no. Just no, Exotic. I'm done. I'm done. I'm gonna unsubscribe if you keep talking about girls. The girls are icky. Girls have cooties. I'm like, child, you listen up here right now. You gonna get a wife sometime in the future and you ain't gonna say that. You understand what I'm trying to say? Okay, I've not gotten a single kill with the apocalypse yet, guys. Problem is everybody has adamant armor. Hey, including me. I can't I can't say badly about adamant armor now. It's a problem. I didn't want to get I didn't want to get adamant armor, guys, because now there's gonna be those idiots in the comment section of my reviews. Like, say I do a review of a weapon that's that's not that fantastic. Like, say I do a simple flamethrower review, and then I actually amazingly get good gameplay with it. There's gonna be some person in the comment section saying something like, The only reason you're getting good gameplay is because you have adamant armor, you noob. If you were me and you had diamond armor, you wouldn't. So yeah, there, there are problems, guys, okay? Look at me. I'm getting all these invisible kills. They can't handle this. Man, you ain't invisible. I can see you loud and clearly. Understand? I mean, I don't see you loudly because you ain't making noise because I can't hear my phone, okay? That's the only problem when I record with my Elgato, guys. That's the, that's why I liked when I recorded with my recording my screen, at the record my screen app thingy when I had iOS 6 on my old iPhone. Um, obviously, I can't use that anymore because... IOS 6 is kind of obsolete, but, like, back then I could actually record and hear whatever's going on in the background, but for me right now, I, I, I never, never can hear anything at all whenever I make a video, so it's, it's kind of disappointing. It's depressing, guys! Oh no, you have the storm hammer! No, I have the crossbow! You have the storm hammer! How am I supposed to kill you? I can't. It's a trick question, guys. I can't. Okay, hold on. Apocalypse time. Boom! Dang it, I missed! Okay, where's this guy? Where are you at? What you doing, little apocalypse man? You can't hide forever, okay? I mean, you probably can because you're probably going to be the one who's going to kill me because I have the apocalypse and it ain't the best weapon in the world. I'm not even going to lie, though. I freaking love the way the apocalypse look. It, I mean, if I was to uh, compare the apocalypse and the alligator in terms of the way they look, I would have to vote the apocalypse, guys, because this one looks really freaking cool. All right? Now you're dead now. Ooh, double kill. That's what I'm talking about. Let me get a triple kill on this. Never mind. Never mind. I was getting too cocky. Everybody's like, exotic, exotic. They're, they're two adamant armored players. You're, you're probably not going to get a triple kill against them. Just just wanted to tell you, but I can kill this guy. You understand that, okay? Little Timmy's sitting there in the comment section like, Exotic, you're such a noob, okay? You can't use the apocalypse right. I'm level 23, and that's the only thing I ever use. And I know how to get the best gameplay ever with it. Well, you know what, little Timmy? Okay? I'm not as fantastic as you. I dream to be as good as little Timmy in the future. What are you doing? Stop. 
No! No! Run away! Run away! Run away from- Oh, you idiot! You freaking killed yourself! Oh my god, cute boy's talking to me. Uh-uh, I'm not that type of person, okay? I go for women, not men. I just wanted to tell you. Do you understand? Okay? Alright, let's continue on. Uh, now that I've gotten that uh, clarified to this guy, how the heck did I get another kill? Oh, turret kill. Alright, I got you! I killed cute boy! He's not too cute anymore when he's dead! Do you understand that, cute boy? Cute boy's like, I'm cute all the time. What are you talking about? Cute boy! No! Don't kill mine! Oh, 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 that's not mine. That's not mine. I thought that was my turret. Whoops. That's me being a noob again, as usual. I mean, was that was that surprising? Did you guys honestly think I was not gonna be a noob? You're dead! Nope. Did I kill myself? Okay, at least I didn't give that guy a point. Hey, you know, it's better to have yourself die than give the other guy a point. I mean, that's a newbie way to look at it, but hey, you know what? It's the truth. All right, continuing on here, 325 points, and I have the Apocalypse. He has the Story of the Power Cannon, and that's... I actually killed him. Holy moly! Apocalypse is not half bad, guys. I like this thing. I really like the Apocalypse. Not even gonna lie, guys, I might use this thing more often. I need to find another random weapon gameplay where I can use the Apocalypse more. Guys, think up random weapon gameplays where I can use the Apocalypse, okay? That'd be greatly appreciated. I would like to use it more than what I'm doing right now, okay? Also, I have, like, a lot of random weapon gameplays, and I need more. Like, I want to have at least 30 random weapon gameplays on call, so I can, like, have this great list to choose from and stuff. So, guys, type everything that you could possibly think of for a random weapon gameplay. Also... Uh, comment the weapons that would be part of that random weapon gameplay because there are some people that comment things like Hey, you know FIFA weapon gameplay would be good and I'm just like I'm sorry I have no idea what the heck could classify as a FIFA weapon and he's like oh come on man You got you got it. You, you got to understand that come on man. I'm, like, I'm sorry. I don't know so yeah comments if you have an idea Just comment what would be actually part of that. Okay, come on katana for the win katana versus vacuumizer it's definitely the Katana, who's obviously the winner out of the two. Look at you, little Mechie Mech. What are you doing? Okay, cause crossbow versus Mech, guys. Come on. Cute boy versus exotic gaming. Is it gonna be cute boy? Or is it gonna be exotic gaming? Cute boy ain't doing anything, so it is. Exotic gaming. Um, not sure what cute boy was shooting at. Cute boy was shooting at the floor. Cute boy didn't like that red carpet. Cute boy wanted the carpet to go away. He wanted to do some house remodeling, so he shot the whole place up, and that, that solved his problem. You know? If you gotta get rid of something, you might as well shoot it. And that, that gets rid of the problem instantly. Guys, people, do, people are gonna freaking take that seriously. I'm like, there's this teacher that I like, at, I mean, I hate at school. So Exotic said, if I have to get rid of the thing, then I can just shoot it. No, please don't. Okay, I don't hold any liability for any stupid things that happen in the near future that uh, people think I've said, okay, there's enough stupid things that I do. <laughs> I say, I do way too many stupid things, guys, okay? All right, you're dead now. Oh my god, what are you shooting me with? What are you shoot? Oh, it's you. You little, you little. You're dead now. Oh, look at you, crossbow to your head. And you're about dead in three. No, never mind. God dang it, guys. I try so hard. I try to get points, but I can't do it. I'm so bad at this game. Even when I have adamant armor. Honestly, I don't really notice the difference. So, I mean, it's, it's, I mean, I probably have a difference, but I'm not noticing it right now. I mean, I probably am, because I'm actually getting decent gameplay with the AK-48. If I was doing it with uh, my ruby armor, I'd probably die a lot. <laughs> a lot of times, I'd probably die. So, be thankful for uh, for having adamant armor now at a time like this when I'm using really underpowered weapons. So, yes, guys. Actually, now that I am thinking about it, it is actually almost towards the end of this video. As crazy as it may seem. Guys, earlier today, I was sitting there playing this amazing Pokemon game. And it was called Pokemon Ash Gray. It was so awesome! Okay? If you guys have ever heard of any sort of emulator for your computer, and you have that, or you might want to consider getting that, please... Get some sort of emulator for your computer or your iPhone. I was playing it on my iPhone with something called GBA for iOS. And, and you're, you're going to have the greatest freaking Pokemon experience ever. Okay? It was a great, great game. All right. So, it's uh, 1440. Oh, look at you. Look at you trying to shoot at me. No. It's the killer. I got a headshot to you. This guy has the alien... What is that? Alien cannon? Oh my god, is that guy the alien cannon? I have not seen anybody use the alien cannon in a very, very long time. 
like a long, long... Well, actually, I take that back. Did somebody use the alien cannon in my alien rifle review? Because I feel like somebody might have. I was kind of stuck there. Didn't really have an option to go anywhere, so that was really unfortunate. All right, who's my next victim? Who's it going to be? It's going to be this guy right over here trying to shoot at me with his secret forces rifle. Look at him. Look at him trying to get his kill against me, but you know what? I am exotic gaming, and I don't let somebody just do that to me, okay? Do you understand? All right. All right, guys. So, I honestly don't have much else I need to say. I probably should end this video pretty soon. Um, I'm happy. I'm really happy that this video turned out all right um, when I was trying to record this earlier. Actually, that was the reason why I came up with the gift box opening video in the first place. So, this was actually my first idea for the video. And then, when I actually joined some servers, you know how when I did my alien rifle review, I got a lot of lag? So, I was just joining servers, and I was getting lag spike after lag spike, and it was just not good for a video. So, I, I decided to do something that I knew would not have any lag, and that would be the gift box opening series, but you guys understand that that really did not turn out too well. So, I, I can promise you guys that there's not going to be a gift box opening video anytime soon. I would, I'm probably going to um, try to see if I can do a review on the Golden Friend somehow, because I really want to do a review on the Golden Friend, because um, I know a lot of people want to see exactly how good it is, so um, I, I, don't, I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it, but I'll figure out a way to review the Golden Friend, guys, okay? Maybe, maybe really soft will actually listen to me and maybe possibly give me the Golden Friend. I've already talked to them before and they didn't give me anything, so um, maybe the second time's the charm. We'll see what happens, so... Yeah, guys, I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys didn't, be sure to hit that like button, comment, favorite, and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Pixel Gun 3D videos. Be sure to go check out my other random weapon gameplays that I've done on my channel. Be sure to go check out the most recent ones that I've done on my channel, including Dater Weapon Gameplay, Electric Weapon Gameplay, um, all these other ones, um, Minor Weapon Gameplay, Futuristic Weapon Gameplay, Winter Weapon Gameplay, Summer Weapon Gameplay, so many, it's hard to count. There's well over 20 of them, and if you found this video enjoyable, you will find the other ones enjoyable, because they were all as equally awesome as this one. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, be sure to go check out my other series that I do on Pixel Gun 3D as well. I do a gun review series, gun comparison series, um, like so many other ones. It's, it's honestly hard to count sometimes. I say that so many times, but it's the truth. <laughs> like, it's seriously difficult to count. Um, I do, I do like... <sighs> I don't even know, 1v1s, Deadly Games campaign, and, and so many more. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and let's go get one last kill. Maybe, possibly. Oh, it's going to be this guy. Hello, good boy, you old dead now. Oh, never mind. God dang it. Here we go. It's going to be this guy. Come on. I was going to get that kill. I promised you guys I was going to get one last kill, and that, that is going to happen. No matter what I do, I'm going to get one last kill. If it's the last thing that I do, it's going to be this guy, because he doesn't know where he's shooting. He's not really shooting at me. Um, there we go. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode.